up YouTube? I'm Sam Bam and in the last video I didn't actually explain to you guys who I am and why I'm here and what I'm doing in your screen. So, my name is Sam. Uh, I have decided to become a YouTuber but actually I've actually decided to become a content creator. So, I don't want to be called a YouTuber because people think that's for the money and the fame. And to be honest, I don't care about any of it. I just want to make you videos. I want to make content. So basically, I thought that I would come to you with this video today um, with random weird facts and questions about me. Um, so you can kind of get to know me a little bit. So my full name is Samantha Jane Darby. Uh, I have an Instagram account which is linked below. City of Love with two E's. Fave brand of makeup. This is my extent of my makeup knowledge. Um, but like, I'm gonna go with like lipsticks and like highlighters. Like you can't really tell, but like, Jeffree Star and ColourPop. Fave flowers. Now, I know you got a lot of flowers, <laughs> a lot of flowers here, but uh, my favorite is actually pink roses. But something I really want. Now I deciphered this as something I really want as in like to buy or money wise first thing I really want my credit card paid off so I have a finance bill for my furniture and once I pay that off I'm gonna buy more furniture my favorite animals now I have some weird animal favorites uh, my favorite animals are actually pandas red pandas goats and sloths Something that worries me. Ooh. So you will see on my channel a little later in the year that I will be uploading some vlogs and some sit down videos and stuff like that. And I will be speaking of this. Uh, but something that is currently worrying me, I am getting spinal reconstruction at the end of the year. So my back kind of does this and it twists in the middle and has two hairline fractures at the bottom. So I am getting it broken in three different parts, so at the top, in the middle, and at the bottom, and then two, like, and then pins, I guess, titanium steel, I don't know, put in my back to straighten my back again. An embarrassing moment in my life. So I have many, like I fall over all the time. I literally can buy a brand new pair of pants and they will split within two minutes. I spill things on myself I am so clumsy like it's ridiculous but one that comes to my mind <laughs> um when I think embarrassing stories is when I was 18 years old my best friend and I Maddie we were coming home from the city um and we were walking back to her house like her parents house at the time we were <laughs> walking back to her parents house at 18 she was 19 and I needed to like pee really bad like really bad and one thing you need to know about me i have a bladder of a two-year-old so if i say i need to pee chances are i need to pee within like two seconds um maddie knows this so she has decided to just make me laugh and now i love everything but especially when it comes to maddie maddie and i have the same kind of humor we have like just everything makes me laugh and maddie knows what those things are and she just did them and pretty much we were like three streets away from her house and i peed myself 18 years old peed myself in the street that's the most embarrassing thing that i feel has happened three habits that i have now i have fake nails Ooh. um and some, I got these fake nails for a specific reason, because I bite them. And for some reason, even with fake nails, I still bite my nails. And I don't understand how, like why or how. I still bite them and I'm confused. Uh, overthinking, uh, but I can overthink myself into a mood and then I can make myself cry from overthinking. And buying things that I don't need. Don't need it bought it anyway looks super cute but yeah mm -hmm. favorite food now i have two favorite 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 foods that i probably could eat for the rest of my life uh and that is spaghetti bolognese now i love 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 oh my god heart spaghetti bolognese like love it, love it. 
fried rice. Number of kids that I want. Uh, this is not for a long time. Like, I'm not having kids for a while. Like, I'm only 23. I'm still a kid myself. I still... <laughs> like, no, not yet. But I would ideally love to have two. A boy and a girl would be incredible but healthy. That's my main. As if, I, if I only ever get one child, then okay, I'm going to love that one child. But as long as that one child is healthy and happy, that's all I care about. I ideally though want to. What did you want to be as a kid? Now, I don't remember this and I don't know why, but I've asked my mum this question many times and every time I get the same answers. So, so, what I wanted to be when I grew up as a kid. So when I was like five years old, I always said to my mum, I would like to be a fire truck. Yes, you heard me. Fire truck not a firefighter no 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 fire truck fire truck fire truck five-year-old sandman wanted to be a fire truck yes yes as i got older and realized that i am a human and cannot be a fire truck i went for something a little bit more realistic I wanted to be a teacher throughout primary school, throughout high school, teacher, 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 teacher. I wanted to be a teacher. When I graduated from school and I, you know, decided to go the back ways into university of being a teacher, because unfortunately I didn't have the best grades, um, study hard at school kids, don't do what I did, um, and started to go back route. So I went to TAFE to be a kindergarten teacher to then gain the points that I needed to be able to get into university to be a primary school teacher. Um, to then gain the points that I needed to be a high school teacher because I wanted to be a high school teacher. I quickly realised halfway through my prac at, pre at uh, the kindergarten that I absolutely hated it. Hated it. Now I know that kindergarten and toddlers are completely different to high school students but they're really not. They throw tantrums, so do they. They throw up, so do they. They don't want to do their work, so do they. I decided it wasn't for me. Love kids. Still want to, you know, influence kids somehow and teach them somehow, but no. Nope. Didn't happen. So 18 to 19 year old me was lost for a little while and didn't really know what she wanted to be uh, until one year at nationals when um, I was skating I saw an old an old uh, ice skating friend from when I was young who I looked up to as like a skater she came with her camera now a big camera and background and lights and I was like what are you doing and she's like I'm taking photos and I was like oh ooh, photos what's that and I pretty much followed her around like a lost puppy. Oh my god, I asked her so many questions. She she inspired me to become, like to go to university for creative arts. And I went to JMC Academy and I studied a bachelor's degree of film and TV. And from that, I fell in love with filmmaking. Now at 23 years old, I want to be a content creator and I know that's going to take me time and I might be at AMR furniture for the rest of my life who knows but my goal and my dream is to become a content creator and an influencer are you a messy or a clean person now I would love to say I'm a clean person but if I said that I would have so many people especially my mum my dad my uh, partner, my best friend, uh, I would have them literally comment liar in capital letters underneath the video because I am so messy. I'm getting better. A little bit. Ooh, guilty pleasure. Sugar. Straight up sugar. I'm addicted to sugar. I love sugar. I will literally eat gummy bears until I throw up gummy bears. I love sugar. Do I have a sibling. Yes, I do. Her name is Amanda and she is a year and two weeks younger than I am and she is severely disabled. Um, my first car. So I had two cars before this car. 
um, on my learners, but they weren't really cars that I would consider as my first car because I didn't get to drive them for long enough, so, all by myself. So I would classify my first car as the first car I got once I got my P plates. So I got a black Ford Fiesta, two door, um, black interior, blacked out windows, um, the passenger seat chair didn't go down so every time somebody like more than one person got in my car I had to get out of my car and lift push my seat down to let them into the car um and they this was this little car was a manual and it was it was zoomy like it would zip around the place it was awesome until about a year and a half later when some drunken driver decided to run a red light and I they kind of did this and I kind of did this and we ran into each other and unfortunately the car is no more. Next question. Are you athletic? <laughs> I used to be. <laughs> I used to be really athletic. From four years old to 19, I was super athletic. I was, like I said before, I was an ice skater. I was in, um... I was in ice skating teams, synchronized ice skating. I so I won cl I won clubs, I won states, I won nationals, go to international competitions, worlds, galas, all of that. Um, super fit. Uh, but now I'm not as athletic. Do you read? Yes, sometimes. Ooh. <laughs> and my favorite author is Kira Cass. Favorite author. But yeah, so that was questions about me that you probably didn't know, which you probably wouldn't have because this is my second video. So I don't have an outro yet, so comment below something that you think I should do for my outro. Um, until I figure something out, um, please like the video, subscribe down below, hit that little bell button to get notifications when I post. I will be posting hopefully twice a week, sometimes maybe... I'm going to try and post as much as I can, and uh, yeah, so like, subscribe, share the video, leave a comment below, and yeah, 